Hello and welcome back. This is episode 35 and we are playing Control. I'm no detective, but something definitely happened here. Blessed organization. This group slash individual has operated outside of the Bureau's notice for decades, perhaps longer, displaying a level of skill and caution rarely seen in paracriminal groups. A review of past cases have found various mentions of their activity over the years. In 2016, a production company called Blessed Pictures was connected to an altered item case, as well as the death of an agent from exposure to illicit paranatural materials. In 1994, a Los Angeles-based public speaker named Chester Bless was involved in the illegal use of an altered item. In 1988, a business called Blessed Repair and Service was suspected of involvement with an object of power case, perhaps even creating it. None of these businesses or individuals have ever been located, however, their connection to appearances of altered items and objects are of power are too direct to be considered circumstantial. An arrest order has been issued for any org persons believed to be involved with the blessed organization. Hey, okay. it's time to reverse. Do we know each other? I feel this feels familiar. I can't seem to... I've forgotten it. I'm sorry. I'm... My name is Alan Wake. friend Tom. Tom Zane. There's nothing to worry about. Tom. The poet. The diver. You, you look different. That was just a, a role. A character. The protagonist I played in my, my old film. I'm a filmmaker. An auteur like yourself. We're working on this together, remember? An artistic collaboration. You need a drink. was Alan Wake, the writer who went missing in that AWE case I read about. What's he doing here? And Thomas Zane was with him. The poet. No, wait. D -d he was a filmmaker. I, I always remember that wrong. I guess we traverse this as usual. 
That was different. Wow. Two of them open. That did not open. Don't have a key yet, so it shouldn't work. Is there nothing else to interact with? What am I missing? Oh, now this door opens. Oh, okay, so that's the key. Well, that's weird. Great, got the key. Dr. Emil Hartman was devoured by hungry darkness. Became the thing that had been Hartman. Broke loose. Killed everyone it could. Lurking, roaming, waiting. Then something else came. A resonance. The thing that had been Hartman went through another change. I don't think we actually see the complete version of those. Dr. Emil Hartman was desperate. The Federal Bureau of Control had stolen his life's work. This was his last chance, his final experiment. What he'd been too scared to do before. Hartman dove into the lake, was taken, devoured by hungry darkness, became the thing that had been Hartman. Only an echo of him remained. Fragmented impulses on autoplay. Violent, bloodthirsty darkness in the driver's seat. Emerging from the lake, the thing was captured by the FBC. Brought in, contained, studied. The thing broke loose. Killed everyone it could. The FBC fell back and sealed the sector. The thing was alone in the dark. Lurking, roaming, waiting. Then something else came. Not darkness, but similar enough. A sound. A resonance. It shouldn't be a surprise. If there's one, why not another? The darkness inside the thing could have been immune, could have resisted, fought, could have been passed by, passed through with no effect. But it didn't, and it wasn't. Maybe it had grown weaker over time, not aged. It was timeless, but weaker with no link to its source. A metamorphosis followed. The thing that had been Hartman went through another change. Okay, great. Now let's skedaddle. Two. Three. Explore the investigations sector. Yes. And I will. Wow, oh, I fucking hate those things. We are probably, according to the map, going to the third one. That means we're gonna have to... There shortly. They never used these uh, yellow uh, indicators in the base game, did they? Those are just been in in the DLC. Damp and abandoned. Why did Wake want me to come here?
bathrooms. A box. Round slam boost. Nothing else. Filing and processing operations center. That doesn't look like a house shift. Do I even want to know? Ooh, a uh, shelter. This place has a lot of shelters. Oh. Just going straight through this. Filing and processing. Aw, oh, crap. Here we go. The wall is blocked off. Actually, we could have a little fun, maybe. Those were not fun, actually. Okay, let's search the offices for info. Gator materials. Nothing in here. There's something in there. Really? There's a box in there, but I can't get in. Interesting. Oh, cannot get in. What? We can break through walls? How am I discovering this now? How? What? Or was that just that wall? Yeah. It was just that wall. It was made for breaking. Okay, hey, Hartman, Emil, Emil, Alan Wake, Anderson, Tor Anderson, there's a lot of victim names, officer names, special agent Remy, charges, kidnapping of altered individuals, sanctioned against altered organizations, obstruction of juro investigation, breaching of the Ash Act. Offenders property seized as evidence to be used in conjunction with an ongoing AWE investigation. Offenders personal effects have been sent to the research for analysis. After being cleared by Bureau researchers, all victims have been released. Biannual surveillance orders were assigned to each, except the Anderson brothers due to their senility and wake, possibly deceased. Okay. Anything in this? 
room. No? <coughs> Nothing in this room either then. Hello, my feet gossip at night, and now I have to wear shoes to bed. Sincerely, me. Okay. Is that where we're going? Ooh, that might be where we're going, actually. Or not. Let's see uh, where this goes first. Wow, my voice. Yeah, okay, so we can't go this way. Actually, there's a box here. What was it? Impact melee boost. Let's check that out, actually. Uh, let's clean this out. Those are the same. Do you have anything else? Those are the same. 28, uh, 18. Those are not the same. That one and that one are the same. Melee source gain. Yes, three and four. Uh, those are not the same. Orange ground slam. Shield efficiency, 19, 18. Shield boost. Evade inch cost, minus 24, minus 16. Okay, rarity. Do we have anything new? Like, pick that up. Rarity. Ammo recovery on evade you. Was that one? All of the uh, type. Do we have anything that's the same? Engine renewal. Remove that one. Those two are the same. Those two are the same. And I think that's it, actually. Pierce. Is this Pierce? Yes, it is. Zoom boost. 32%. That's not a lot. Okay, we're not going this way. That's obvious. So. Service tunnel, here we go. Aim at aim a powerful light source at the darkness to destroy it. This darkness is blocking the door. So now I have to deal with an interdimensional noise and sentient shadows. Okay. But how do you aim a powerful light source at it? Huh. Just like that. Light burns it away, huh? Makes sense. Interesting. That's new behavior. That guy's crisp. Wait, 
question now. Do we go... We do not go in... <coughs> Control point. Does that mean we're gonna be having a fight soon? <coughs> That's the other side. Going towards Operation Center, active investigations, yes. The third thing. The sound made darker, the darkness made louder. Hartman was stretched like a worm through time. The third thing was a monster. Now we crashed out of darkness toward Faden. I want to do this again. <laughs> the third thing. The resonance carves its way through the thing that had been Hartman. Yeah, this does not start the way as it did outside. The sound changes the darkness, and the darkness changes the sound. They both changed what remained of Hartman. They all turned into something else. A third thing. The sound made darker. The darkness made louder. Hartman was stretched. Stretched. As anyone when seen from out of time, like a worm through time. Almost an Ouroboros, a spiral, a maelstrom. The gravity well of a black hole, twisting inward, tightening, taking you deeper and deeper to the bottom, the heart, and through to the other side. The third thing said, when you hear this, you will know you're a new you. He said, we build you till nothing remains. He said, under the conceptual reality behind this reality, you must want these ways to drag you away. He said, baby, 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 yeah, Orange Peel. The third thing was a monster. He'd tear apart any ordinary person crossing his path. Now we crashed out of darkness toward Faden. There was nothing ordinary about Faden. Yeah, they're not the same. I want to go that way. You're gonna have to bring a light wherever we go now. It's because that's a new thing. How do you just drop it without actually shooting it? <coughs> A train derailment resulting in 62 casualties and numerous injuries was suspected to have been the work of a paracriminal group known as HMM. As a result of this event, the agents discovered that one of the cars had become altered with a persistent auditory event. It remains to be determined whether the AWD was spontaneous or the direct result of the sabotage. The Bureau had been tracking said group at the time and the intel gathered suggests an event of this caliber was imminent in Bloomington. As a result, a response team on site was able to respond to the train accident site within minutes of its occurrence, they arrived to find emergency processes underway, but also equipment left behind by the suspected group. A suspicious onlooker managed to elude agents after they attempted to make contact. 
But the investigation of the accident site revealed a curiously da undamaged train car that exhibited an altered state when entered. This individual car was secured and transported to the investigation sector for further studies. The Shadow Paranatural Entity A010 aka The Shadow is an aggressive hmm consisting of three known types. Type A, a localized manifestation of sentient hmm capable of occupying organic and inorganic material as well as exerting hmm over its surroundings. Type B, shaded individuals, human bodies hmm by the shadow. These individuals uh, become notably more aggressive but do seem to retain hmm of their previous selves. Research is ongoing as to whether this condition is reversible. Type C, shaded objects. Similar to type B, except that inanimate objects are hmm, solely to be used as destructive tools. Each type seems uh, to work towards a shared goal, possibly targeting certain individuals, CAW35, which may imply a shared link to a shared to a hmm intelligence. The third, uh, the threat this entity poses warrants immediate exploration of offensive slash defensive measures. The investigation sector is being outfitted with additional lighting sources, some internally powered, to prepare for the eventuality of hmm. Hey. <clears throat> My understanding of the darkness is fragmented, incomplete. This abyss, this void. It very much does not wish to be understood. If light symbolizes knowledge, then it stands to reason that darkness would equate to ignorance. By its very nature, it abhors comprehension. Of course, my own nature drives me to comprehend all. We are opposing forces, destined to collide. And given this conflict of natures, we know that the light of truth will burn away the darkness, both figuratively and literally. Any significant light source can be used as protection, even weaponry, against this metaphysical gloom. And then there are the artists. I know for a fact that Tom, Wake, the Anderson brothers, and Lane all had some involvement with the darkness. The question is whether their uncanny ability to affect reality through their art beckons the darkness, or did their work perhaps even create it? With Wake now secure in my lodge, I expect I shall grow closer to learning the answers to these questions. Assuming he cooperates, which is proving quite the challenge. Well, perseverance is the foundation of knowledge. Speaking of, I must be off on my rounds. Hey. Ooh, got one of those light sources. Turn that off on, but shall we go downstairs first? Wow. Okay, so the stairs are just what the fuck? It's just two staircases to the same area. Doesn't matter which one we take. What the fuck? Who the fuck was shooting? Oh, there.
think that was all of them. Let's uh, search the downstairs. We haven't been in here. Oh, it's just the bathroom. But this just the bathroom actually has a tape recorder. Reminder, all employees are required to report their hours at the end of each month. The Federal Bureau of Control maintains that time is not subjective and hours passed on alternative planes cannot be claimed. Astral dives do not accumulate overtime compensation. Thank you for your attention. Okay, so we're going out the other direction. Let's just check this wall first. Following the NASA slash FBC coordination agreement of 1972, the Bureau has provided NASA with numerous technological advancements based on our research, including the black rock lining now found in all space fairing vessels. In return, all data gathered during space, mis space missions is made available for Bureau researchers to analyze. Recently, certain individuals have raised the concern that this relationship does not inadequately fit the benefit the Bureau, either intellectual or financially. A thorough examination of the costs secured accrued by both organizations have shown that the expense of NASA's recent launch of the hmm far outweighs any spending related to the processing and delivery of black rock. From its medium or Earth orbit, the HMM will provide the Bureau with an unparalleled resource for remotely monitoring and photographing AWE sites, a resource that would be lost if the partnership ends. It is the opinion of this committee that maintaining a cooperative relationship with our colleagues at NASA is of vital importance. His Ranger Airborne. This subgroup of his corrupted rangers has manifested the ability to levitate, similarly, similarly to his elevated agents. However, this these airborne his rangers display no telekinetic abilities and simply continue to use mundane bureau weaponry. This evolution being so similar to the elevated possibly indicates that his can share permutations through a type of network or perhaps osmosis. However, the fact that this development in his rangers has only been observed in the investigation sector may indicate that an environmental factor is responsible. They could be responding to an altered item or a other paranatural element found only in that sector. Or perhaps this is a natural progression of the his ranger phenotype. Not enough time has passed to determine a conclusive trajectory of development for each of the his manifestations, assuming any such trajectory exists. Okay, and that was just the My understanding of the dark. That was just the two media we listened to earlier. This is a bathroom with the box. Ballistic Ground Slam Boost. Hidden File. A black market hub specializing in the trade of occult talismans, relics, and other assorted ceremonial objects, as well genuine altered and paranatural material, was raided in hmm, Czech Republic by a team of special investigators. Unsuccessful attempts by suspect. Suspects to escape using altered items resulted in numerous casualties and prevented the Bureau from questioning all participants. The following interrogations reveal that not only is there a vast network of these retailers, but that they seem to be gathering information on altered items and other paranatural materials from sources unknown to the Bureau. The Bureau's concern here is threefold. There is a growing underground market for paranatural materials which implies a growing awareness of their existence among a niche group of the general public. These criminal individuals do not seem aware of the item's supernatural powers, and their attempts to activate them could prove devastating if done in populated areas. The motivation of these collectors are largely unknown. Okay. Uh, um. Mm -hmm. Agent Fisher, 
day six inside the motel. Utilized surveillance methods are as follows. Fiber optic cameras slid under the individual room doors. Motion detectors in the lobby area. Tripwire triggering a flash camera across the main entrance, even fingerprint powder on the front desk. Results are varying at best. But mostly just inconclusive and unusable. The footage is corrupted. Sometimes even the equipment is damaged. I don't know how exactly. I, uh, I think this place is making fun of me. That's the only explanation. I, I can hear them laughing and screaming behind the closed doors. I can hear the call bell going ding multiple times a day, but when I look, there's no one there. I know I'm supposed to stay out of sight, but I've seen the doors closing just before I can catch even a glimpse of anyone or anything. They're messing with me, whoever they are. I think, wait, shh. There's something. I gotta get this, gotta get the cable out. Come on, you fiber optic fuck, cooperate. Okay, there we go. All right, that was fake, but I definitely heard the movement coming from the hallway. I think I might have finally caught one. Ha, <laughs> the recording better work this time or I swear to God, I'll... What? Hello? Who's there? Oh, shit. I'm with the FBC. Move away from the door. I have a... Where's my... Was that the end? It's still going. Can't wait there forever. Doesn't look like there's any documents here. It's still going. It is. Okay then. Looks like there's... I'm wondering, are those tasks? Darkness everywhere. Yeah. Those are just... Those are just... Uh, Get rid of it. Side missions. Big investigations. Uh, I don't feel right. Something in this darkness is draining me. 